here we are at the RV, and as I promised, we've got the new power bank from Fantic. This is their 300 watt, it's kind of the smaller, the 300 watts that kind of smaller accessory kind of stuff. I typically said before that I wouldn't use a CPAP with this. For the past week, I've been using my CPAP on this one, and it's worked to get me through a full eight hours. Doesn't have a ton of juice left at the end of the day, but it does do it. Now, this also is the Fantic, the new 100 watt portable solar panel. Let me show you the back of this here. It's got the little fold out kickstands. They're not super rigid, but they work just fine. You got the, it's a, what I call a, a semi-rigid. It's not fully flexible, but that means it's gonna last longer. It's gonna hold up to more. It's got this new coating on it that gets you better protection and more energy. And it just plugs right back into the Fantic here. Let me give you some info on the solar panel here. We got 100 watts, fastest charger, 3.5. Anyway, it just shows you with the different banks how much it'll charge. You get one panel, you get the cable bag, and you get the cable with it, and the user manual. Very exciting. Here's the bag that comes with it. Not much to it. Straps around it, holds everything. But let's talk about the box, okay? Here's the one problem I'm going to say with this box. That's it. Let me turn on the display. And you can't tell it's on at all. Maybe I just turned it off. There it is. This is in bright daylight here in Las Vegas. Really hard to see. At night, it is an absolutely gorgeous display. I'll try to show it in some shadow here in a minute. Let's go over some of the features on it real quick. So, here's the DC side. There's the AC side. You want to turn the DC on, you press this button. You want to turn the AC on, the inverter, you press that button. You have one 12 volt here. If I can get my fingernail in there. Cedar cigarette lighter kind of plug. This is nice. So this has in and out on the USB-C. So if you don't have your charger or something else, you can always plug it into like a phone charger or something like that. I love that about this box. You got your standard five volt, three amp, quick charge three times. You got your five volt. 2.4 amp and you got these standard, I don't know why they do the barrel things do you use those does anybody out there seriously is anyone out there plugging DC to DC it is I'll be honest if you're going to be serious about charging stuff it's the fastest way to do it it's the most efficient rather than going through an adapter and converting stuff because every time you convert something you get lost but let's get back to the box so the sides have this basic decorative panel nothing to it nothing on the bottom it doesn't have the quick charge on top not an issue for me because i don't use quick charge phones on the back we have this light doesn't seem like much now trust me in the dark it is really bright and it does all the different patches. in fact i think somebody let me see if it does the sos so you got dim high and Oh, looks like it's doing it right. Okay, that's your standard charger adapter, and it comes with the charger and everything. And this is the solar adapter right here. You just plug into there, and you're charging with the solar cells. I, of the 300-watt boxes I've tried, this is by far the best one so far. Now, Fantic sent me a link. It's going to go to the Amazon store. They have a huge sale going on right now. I don't remember exactly what the price is. I think it's going to be around $250, $260 in that realm, which for something like this, for a quality box like this, is fantastic. Now, let me see if I can take it and get it in some shade here so you can actually see what this display looks like. We'll put it back here under the covers there. Hey, it's just so bright out here. That's the one thing about this box. You can see me. You see me just fine. I just wish the display was better. It powers up great. It does a great job, of course. The Fantic stuff there. They make good products, solid products. Look at the construction on this. As you can see, that's a semi-rigid. Really nice. It's got magnetic. It's got these indentations here. They're magnets clasped together holds really strong i don't know so what do you think sorry about that the cold air is getting to me what do you think is this something that you would use i've been using it i like using it 
Um, it's light, it's portable, it's easy power. Now here we're in an RV park. We got tons of power, don't really need it. But we've been boondocking and when we boondock, <laughs> it's a lifesaver. Literally, I use it for my CPAP every night. Uh, also, we got these e-bikes. I don't know if you can see them, we got a couple of e-bikes. You can charge e-bikes off of them, you can charge laptops, you can charge all sorts of stuff. We talked about the other one, the, that little green lunchbox thing. Not really a fan of it. I'm a huge fan of this. They did send it to me for free. Want to get that out there. So take it, you know, make your own judgments on this. Don't just listen to me. Do some research, shop around and stuff. I will put a link down below uh, and you can check it out if you want. Anyway, that's all I got for you today. You all take care and God bless. And as always, shine on. Let me leave you with a view of Lake Mead there.